Be cautious about the establishments you visit. Be cautious about the medium you engage with. Be cautious about the spirit communicating through the medium. Be careful because many things can occur. The medium may not be truly incorporated, they may be entirely caught up in animism and talk about themselves, attempting to appear as a gifted medium. Alternatively, they may be incorporated, but who is the spirit they are channeling? Who is the spirit? Just because they are disembodied does not signify anything. They don't know everything. There are many embodied individuals who know much more than numerous disembodied spirits. A person who was an engineer during their incarnation, when they pass away, will they suddenly possess knowledge of medicine? They do not possess medical knowledge, they will continue to only be knowledgeable about engineering matters. Therefore, disembodiment does not bestow magical omniscience upon an individual. That spirit may be conveying a lot of nonsense to you. Mediumship was not created for fortune-telling. Mediumship was intended to foster progress, promote evolution, convey messages to aid your growth, to help you transcend ignorance, to expand your consciousness, to liberate your consciousness. That is what mediumship is for. Mediumship is not for fortune-telling. Mediumship is not for predicting the future, unless it is truly necessary and beneficial to many. In such cases, a few details about the future may be shared. I'm not saying it's impossible because it is possible, but it will be an exceptional occurrence. Mediumship is for progress. There is no such thing as, I've been waiting for you for so long. 